Nigel Productions here, and happy Easter to all that see this video. Uh, well, so in today's video, um, I, uh, I want to show all of my favorite Disney Pixar cars, and um, and at the end, we are actually gonna open a car. Well, 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 yeah, we're just gonna open something. Well, if, of course, it's Disney Pixar cars, but you. A lot of you guys have um, commented that why don't you do unboxings um, and can you unbox this car um, but I do not I don't really like opening my cars well of course like if you're a toddler or something you would love opening cars like me I used to love opening cars but now um, I don't uh, just because if I open it, the value will go down a little bit. I don't know if it will go, like, all the way down. But, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. Um, let's start off with the first car. It's really, it's, this decision is really hard. So, for the number six spot, um, it has to be, um, Memo Rojas Jr. Um. This car is really cool. Um, of course, I'm Mexican, and well, he's Mexican too. Uh, but it's really, really cool. Um, well, the only mistake that they made is um, on the eyes right there, they're brown, and on the eyes right there, they're blue. So, um, just really weird. Um, right here it says, as seen in the mexican version of the movie and of course it was in the mexican version of the movie um the cars that i bought this guy from this guy all have that p1 thing right there i don't know what it stands for i don't know if i should take it off probably like something that means that it's worth something i don't know um i'm just gonna have to check that later online see if p1 means something um so next car has to be the lightning storm lightning mcqueen this guy is really 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 cool um as as you um if you know this uh this guy was actually one a car that i bought from ebay not too long ago um well yeah what I like about this car is you see that up there, that uh, little uh, missile thing. That thing is actually not on the normal car, the one that uh, they actually sell at stores. This car was, uh, um, for you guys that don't know, this car was actually in the uh, 2000, um, uh, six it come com uh, um, convention, um, and yeah uh well of course this car actually has it really cool as you can see there i think there's more um missiles on the car i think there was only missiles right here on the sides but not in the middle right there just really really cool um he of course metallic and right there it says uh disney pixar cars lightning storm lightning mcqueen has that dynaco um, bolt another dynaco bolt over here and he has that stand to so he could look like he's flying and in the back i don't know what that is oh more missiles so in the back as you can see right there that thing right there that thing in the back you can see tim but that thing right there in the back is missiles so like if he flies he could and someone like something is like in the air like over here he could just shoot and if something like a tank or something's in like the on the bottom he could just shoot and it, it would just explode or something like that but yeah next car is uh one of my favorite out of well like if if i had a lot of glow up uh disney pixar cars it has to be uh, 
light up Tokyo Mater. Um, as you can see there, he can actually turn on. So, yeah. It has some. He has some sponsors right there. He has RPM, Vitaling, maybe like Topper's Pizza right there. That thing right there, that little tomato, or and then something else right there. I don't know what it says, but yeah, really cool car. As you can see right there, it has the um, the flames. I'm gonna light it up for you guys one more time, cause it's really, it looks really cool. Like if you have the uh, lights off, it's really cool. Um, so the lights are not on the car; they're actually right there, um, below the car. So if you take it out of the package, I do not think it would glow. Um, but yeah, it's still really cool. It's new in package. Um, it's never been open. Really cool. You can see there's a um, picture of him right there. So yeah, really cool car. Um, I should say. Um, I don't know how much, how many there were there were made because. There's another one that I really wanted wanted to ask the guy. I asked him. Look at those letters. But yeah. So I wanted to ask him if there was any more. But the guy said um, that he, there w wasn't. Well, he, there wasn't any more in the convention. And he just had to get this one. So yeah, really cool. Next up, it's this is so hard, guys, to pick which one. Uh, well, so um, Memo Rojas is in six in the sixth spot. Uh, uh, Lightning McQueen, the um, the one with the missiles, in is in number um five, the number five spot, and Tokyo Mater is in, in the number four spot. Um, so so. In the number three spot, it has to be. <sighs> this car is really cool, but I actually I have to put them in the number three spot because I like another car too. Um, this car was only made in uh well, was in a uh, convention. I don't know. I think it was a Kmart exclusive. In uh, Germany, as you can see right there, um, well, the the right the writing is in German. I don't. I think that's German. I don't know, but yeah, really, really cool. Another P1 right there. But it and also this car is my has to be my favorite Lightning McQueen. Just because it's an italic, I don't know how much it goes for. I think I would say like a hundred bucks. I don't know. But right there, it's the mud splat um, right there. And white wall tires. Really, really cool. Look at that shine. Really cool. Really, really cool. So yeah, that that car is in number in the number three spot. So yeah, next up is for the number two spot. It is Miles Axelrod with open hood. This guy has to be one of my favorite cars in my collection. Well, my second favorite car in my collection, um, just because his open hood. There has never been another open will open hood car that could open the hood except this car well i there was only one and it's lightning mcqueen it from the disney disney uh california adventure um if you went there there was actually a um exclusive with like uh i think uh time travel mater and uh 
the Lightning McQueen had an open hood, uh, but uh, sadly I couldn't get that car yet. I probably um, like for my birthday next year, I really want to get um, probably Stanley with um, with um, Lizzie and that. Well, the, that the Mater and the um, well, the the, the Mater and uh, Lightning McQueen and Stanley go for uh, a lot, but uh, the Lizzie and Stanley don't go for a lot. So I'll probably get the Liz Lizzie and Stanley, and then get the um, Ramon and uh, I mean no, the other one. I forgot the Lightning McQueen with the open hood car set. Get that one. As you can see here, he, he's right here, and a uh, Holly Shifwa with screen. Uh, you the bomb mater and Mike Lauren Jean. Jean, I don't know. I don't have this one or that one yet. I have these these two right here. Um, and really cool. Um, he, he's four out of nine. But yeah, moving on to the number one spot. It is <sighs> probably you guys know who it is. Maybe one person. But it is Race Damage Mood Springs. This car is my most expensive car, I think. I don't know. I think I have one more that's expensive. But this car has to be one of my most expensive Disney Pixar cars and my favorite Disney Pixar car in my whole collection. I have a lot of cars here. Um I have a bunch of Hot Wheels and cars um and none of them beat um, race damage mood springs the ch the chances of still finding a in this in the well target stores is zero you can't find any more may uh, if you go on eBay there's probably some um, probably opened or some that will um or some that are um, uh well just like in the package but this has a funny story to it um i actually told uh the last video i did uh was on uh trg um but i actually told him that um i actually got the well he well if is you if you can see the video i'm gonna put it in the link in the description um that well i'm just gonna put that video in the link in the description that I actually got this guy for da, 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 six dollars like no joke like if I if I uh, just like told the guy how much I paid for it it was six dollars I, I got this one and galloping gear grinder um, that day and I think uh, it was also van um, but this was one this guy was my favorite. I I don't even think that guy had a clue on how much this car actually cost. Like, oh my gosh. I hope in the future, I really hope that um, Mattel starts putting out more damaged cars. Because the only car from the Piston Cup, it, uh, well, the only cars is this one from the uh, south uh, speedway of the south that they made only this one and but there's another damaged car here um here is damage to the king another uh damaged car but he was in uh well the the other um the other um how do I say the other race the yeah this race that they were on the motor speedway of the south no 
I don't know what, what what is it called what it's called but I actually have two of these probably for another giveaway I don't know but yeah if someone would come into my room and another collector and they would say hey man uh can how much for the mood springs I would say no deal this car is my favorite I can't sell it to you no but yeah here's mood springs really cool car right there yeah but now it's time for the unboxing guys um just yeah so finally finally for 15 you guys say probably for 15 minutes and here he this well it's it's not like a big um cool thing but hopefully you guys some of you guys are okay with this um um but yeah uh as you can see there's three cars the only cool car is this ramon um there's a part of me that don't doesn't want to open it but because you guys asked for uh, asked for a um unboxing here you go um an unboxing so yeah let's just open this uh, guy up <coughs> that's satisfying just heard that finally finally well I think I did two unboxings in my channel um, but this is the third one um, the two other ones weren't, weren't that um, cool but what is this I'm just gonna throw these guys away I mean no we're not throw these guys away um, here they are all here um, and here is the main topic of well this unboxing which is um, Ramon here he is he is really cool as you can see I'm gonna shine it to the light and there is that beautiful uh, metallic I mean a metal I mean gold shine to it of course it's not real gold but really really cool uh, here are other boring cars right here which is lightning McQueen um, I think he's kind of boring because he will probably, um, because we're on lockdown and stuff, um, well, you can't get out of your house, but if you want to go to your porch and stuff, you can, uh, but you can't go too out, um, out of, like, out of your house, um, uh, but right here, we're safe, so probably, um, uh, I really want to do a custom, uh, and this video has been really long, but uh, I'm trying to make like like make my videos shorter for you guys. But yeah, here they are. Um, of course, I can't make another like delete this video and make another one because you guys would miss out on the cars, and it's the most boringest car in this whole thing which is Mater but I actually can't believe Mattel actually um, thought of making um, but I mean uh, metal cars so yeah my f just my favorite favorite car in this like thing was this one probably one of what well, uh, uh, out of all of my mini racers I have quite a few mini racers but out of all of them i think ramon is my favorite um um oh look at it. so yeah um 
I think I'm gonna end it off here, guys. Uh, so comment, like, and subscribe. Turn on those notifications so you don't miss on any of my videos. I'm sorry if this was 20 minutes. I'm trying to. I'm really trying to make my videos more like, um, like, well, just like a uh, time that's not like too long for you guys. But yeah. Um, as always, made her stay there. As always, Nightmare Productions out.